Hey guys, this is uh, Dwarf Guy 66 um, with um, the notice. Now, some of you may turn this off, but please listen because if you don't listen, then you may be disappointed over the next few months. Um, right, due to um, the temperatures getting um, lower and lower, I can no longer run my trains up in the attic because it has no insulation at all. Um, apart from the floor to keep us warm under here. Um, so all my trains are down there on a, on a shelf for the winter months. I have however um, brought down my rolling road I think. Yeah, yeah it's um, on that shelf there. <laughs> Sorry about But um, anyway, um, as, some of, as some of you may be aware or some of you may know um, if like me you um, are interested in um, this as well as model trains. Um, the um, October, November, December months, um, even January, February, are uh, the time for the biggest games of the year, including um, one of the most anticipated ones um, from the world's biggest game franchise ever, Call of Duty series, Modern Warfare 3. I have pre-ordered it, and it will be arriving hopefully for the 8th of November, but, um, so, yeah. Instead of model trains, I will be reviewing um, a few games, games that I get. Um, although I will kick it off with one that I have already bought. This one, Formula 1 2011. I can say that I've seen videos of its predecessor and that is exactly why I bought the game. It is, this is unbelievably brilliant. I will be reviewing it both on camera for the box and the manual inside. The disc is in my computer. Um, also, <laughs> sorry about that. Um, camera's a bit loony. Uh, well, not really, but you know. <laughs> I suck at self humour. I suck at humour, actually. But um, anyway, um, there's two that I can review. Although I will mention some of the some of the games that have come out or are coming out in the next few months, or even this month. Um, at the end of this month, on the 28th of October, I think it is, Battlefield 3 will be coming out, which is Call of Duty's main rival at the minute. And I've spoken to a lot of friends, and they have said, why are you getting Modern Warfare 3? He said, well, I'm a Call of Duty person. As well as being about model trains, I'm also about games. Um, but yeah, I will be reviewing uh, Formula 1, I will be reviewing Modern Warfare 3. Um, I may even review Battlefield, 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 Battlefield 3. I've got it now. Battlefield 3, as soon as I get some money. That's also another reason why I can't review model trains at the minute. I have pretty much no money. I only had a, a bit to spend, and I spent it on Modern Warfare 3. But, um, anyway, besides the point, um, I hope, um, well, this is um, also something to say, uh, thank you to all my subscribers, all my friends on YouTube, thank you very much. Um, it means it means a lot that you watch my videos. Um, but um, my phone's just gone off. <laughs> um, right. Sorry about that guys, um, one of my friends just, just decided to text me. But um, I'll be looking at that in a minute. Anyway, back to business. Um, so yeah, I'll be reviewing games like F1 2011, another one, uh, Railwax 3 Train Simulator 2012. It is the most up-to-date copy. I had its predecessor, so I got a free upgrade. Um, it's available now at 30 quid. I think something like that. Maybe, maybe less. Um, but if you want any more info about the two games, uh, info for this game can be found at www.formula1-game.com or if you look right there on the bottom of your screen now it should appear if I can edit it right <laughs> um, and for Railwax 3 again the um, link is in the bottom but if it doesn't turn up it is www.railsimulator.com ok I'll see you later guys